I'm going to be hosting Around the Blockchain tonight. The new money gang, 10 rules of the hustle. I'm bullish. I'm bullish. Huge, huge news. Paraguay seems to be the second country to start adopting Bitcoin as a currency. I didn't take any note cards. Don't be out here saying I took note cards. What's going on, TJ? Just getting ready to do another uh, Atlanta Angels weekly update. We have a special guest with us here today that's going to do a new intro for us. All right. Hi. How are you? Good. What's your name? Miley. Miley. Nice to meet you. Thank you. <laughs> how are you, Christy? I'm good. How are you? Pretty good. We got any big news for the show today? We got a $2,000 grant from the Sandy Springs Society, so that was super exciting. Right. Um, they didn't call us or anything. We just found it in our mailbox, so wow. that was fun. It's a nice surprise. Yeah. Beep. Focused on the back-to-school drive, <laughs> nice. and uh, all y'all are helping with that, so we're excited to get those to families later next month. Awesome. What's all the commotion? Man, no. we got more peanut butter from American Dream Nut Butter. Uh, this stuff is so good. We all love it. They send us a bunch of boxes. They're definitely the best. Yeah, look at us. Mint chocolate, we can't get enough chip of it. Dream. Holy I mean, they, they might put crack in it. That's how good it is. <laughs> <laughs> Not that I've done crack. <laughs> oh my goodness. Thank y'all so much. We, everyone in the office loves this stuff. Yeah, I think it was you that so shouted them out last time, right? The I, mean, and I think everyone has shouted, uh, <laughs> shouted them out at this <laughs> time. It's so good. Yeah. That's true. Yeah, we're pumped. Strawberry blast peanut butter. Strawberries and peanut butter. It'll taste good. Oh yeah. Play Django with this peanut butter. Should I leave it as a surprise for Ali? Yes. All right. That's a beautiful piece of art there. Right? Good work. Contemporary art. Yeah, I'm trying to come up with some smart title for this beautiful piece it's of art. Oh no, it's a, it's a, it, it says it's right, right here. American Dream. Look at that. Nina's an artist. Nick. Tuna cans. <laughs> <laughs> they call me Nick Tuna Can de Mundi. Oh, right. I'm not going to ask why. <laughs> what is going on, dude? Uh, uh, so well, look. You had a quick change of plans, it seems, huh? With the scripts or... Oh, yeah. You know, when you're the voice of a generation and a lyrical genius like Ben Armstrong is, you got to you gotta roll with the punches and you got to got to be on top of things. So we're changing the schedule around. Me and the uh, the other researchers and writers, uh, we're always on top of things. So we're always ready for, for Ben's changes because we're playing jazz here, folks, okay? This isn't, we're not, you know, following a recipe, coming up with it. It's like Gordon Ramsay, right? Like, we're just adapting on the fly. So that's how it is, nice. Good Boy Crypto. That's how we make the art. That's how we make the art. Nice. So Allie, they turned your desk into an art exhibit. It's beautiful. It is beautiful. So are you okay with uh, Nina's artwork being on your desk? I actually, I love it, and I'm gonna see how long we can keep it there. All right, nice. We have to preserve it. Maybe we'll glue it together. I like it. <laughs> <laughs> you know, whether it's from the studio stuff here, whether it's interview stuff, and then we make like the individualized TikToks. Okay. Yeah, that sounds good. So what are we shooting today, boys? The rules of the hustle. Yes, the, the, the hustle. new money gang, 10 rules of the hustle. Pretty much the Bible that you need to live by if you want to be a side hustler. Okay. Right. Pretty cool. It's going up on YouTube or it's a live stream? So this is going to go up on YouTube. Uh, this is going to be something that we will turn into a full series. Obviously, we're going to go through the 10 rules today, but then each rule will become its own video, and then we'll start doing some more standalone content around there. Plus, we're going to do a whole TikTok series on each one of them. Oh. What the hell y'all doing? I'll slide with you. Yeah. We're stealing this iMac. Uh, best group of criminals I've ever seen right here. Mm -hmm. <laughs> a natural Jesse and Walter situation. So you guys are trying something new today, or? We're doing bullish or bearish. It's gonna be possible new series or a new segment where we basically pull Ben aside and we ask him if he's bullish or bearish on different things. It could be crypto, or it could be like, are you bullish or bearish on the Backtree Boys? It could be anything. <laughs> That's actually a good one. <laughs> and we're testing it on Hit Network. It's gonna be a lot of fun. We're gonna see, we're just gonna see if it receives well, if y'all enjoy it a lot, or if not, We'll pull it, which is building out new ideas for the channel, and we think that this one has a lot of promise. Yeah, definitely. Nice. I've spent like $10 at a garage sale and made like 500 before. Really? Yeah, you just gotta find the garage sale with people who are willing to part with their things. The one we went to last Friday, 
we went and the guy was like, yeah, I'm a collector. Never, bad uh, thing. You don't want to hear that. You want to yeah. hear, we're moving. We yeah. want it all gone. <laughs> you guys going before. garage selling tomorrow? We are. You do like 20? Yep. So for the, uh, the $100 to 10K challenge, we're going to go garage selling tomorrow. We're each going to take the same amount of money and then we're going to talk to our resident expert uh, to see who had made the best decisions and the winner of that, like what you know, like say you buy a couple of things and the value because you should sell for a hundred bucks, and mine's eighty. You know, Brian would have won that challenge, and that means I got to spin the wheel of opportunity. Bullish. Throw them in the microwave for about ten seconds. Makes for a really good little snack in the morning. Um, high on sugar, so I don't usually eat them as much as I used to. But uh, you know, strawberry pop tart. Ten seconds in the microwave. Perfect. Beautiful stuff. <clears throat> How'd it go, boys? Went well. I think, think I think it went. I'm, I'm bullish. Bullish on bears and bulls. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. Me too. Super bullish. It was fun. We do we do this thing where basically we give TJ 15 seconds or Ben 15 seconds to answer bearish or bullish about the thing. So it's kind of fun. It kind of keeps it like fun and high energy trying to answer the question before the 15 seconds is out. So oh, nice, nice yeah. little personality quiz. Yeah. But yeah, basically you get to find out about what the bearish and bullish on like crypto stuff or pop culture stuff or just literally anything. And I thought, I mean, it's just turned out really well. So if you have any topics or suggestions for bearish or bullish, please comment uh, suggestions below and uh, we'll probably use them. We'll more than likely use them. So if you have any ideas, please shoot them to us. So for the concept of bearish or bullish, are you bearish or bullish on the video idea? Let us know in the comments, bearish or bullish. So TJ, how do you feel about the bearish or bullish shoot? Bearish or bullish? I really liked it. I'm bullish. You know, I think uh, I thought it was a lot of fun. It was more fun than I was expecting. Uh, doing the quick hitters was really cool. Um, hopefully the audience likes it. So we'll have to wait and see what they say. Uh, but I think it'll turn out well. But, you know, we'll have to wait. What the comments say, are you bearish or bullish on it? What's up, DZ? What's going on, man? What's going on, brother? Uh... Tell you what, man, we got a pretty crazy day today uh, for the 5 p.m. live stream. We got no TJ. No TJ today. Ooh. And no Ben. <sighs> so uh, I'm just trying to make sure I uh, have. So Jay Chains is going to be hosting. I'm just trying to make sure he's guys, just guys, over. Wait, wait, wait. Breaking news. Breaking news. Justin Williams is actually bullish. That never happened. Whoa. Bye. On what? Huh? He's bullish on what? On crypto. Oh, hang He's on. Always he is the resident bear, so if Justin Williams is bullish, everybody should be buying right now. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> 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 and now back to your regularly scheduled program. But uh, yeah, yeah. So uh, Jay Chains is uh, going to be hosting. So I'm just trying to make sure he is just super prepared. Uh, we can get to him. Me and him can sit down a little bit ahead of time. Give him time to read the articles that uh, we might be referencing. And uh, huge, huge, huge news. Paraguay seems to be the second country to start adopting Bitcoin as a currency. And that's just so big. Domino effect. Dominoes are starting to fall. All right. Oh my God. What? Wait, wait, bro. Hold no, on. The I real did. story is Decker and the waitress. At lunch, there was oh. a moment. There was a moment. Dude, I, I well, tell us all about it. Decker, what happened? <laughs> oh, no. Literally <laughs> <that's> <laughs> The continuation of cyberbullying <laughs> happened at lunch. This guy, he cyberbullied me, and there were, I mean, hey, I'm they were, I did it in real life. It wasn't cyberbullying. <laughs> yeah, well, I was really there. So you went to a steakhouse, and they were, what were they, they were trying to set you up with the waitress, or what? Oh boy, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Tell her her name, what was her name? Oh, God. Sage. <laughs> no, so at the end, this guy, He's like, did you do what you did? You were like, <laughs> I have no idea what he's talking about. You need to ask for her name. And I'm like, dude, I'm eating steak. Like, I'm not <laughs> out here trying to pick up waitresses and stuff. And he, the waitress Sage comes back and he's like, what's your, what's your name again? He really, really wants to know. You know, he's been asking all night. And so he threw me out of the bus right at the end. That's exactly what happened. This story started with Decker got a girlfriend over lunch. <laughs> well, we didn't know. I'm trying so, to get him an Atlanta girl. You know, so he, he misses he misses home. Trying to get him a, a local girlfriend. <laughs> the real question is, did he get the number? No, he chickened out. So DZ, what happened at what happened last night with Decker and the waitress? Oh, so yeah, me, Justin, and Decker, we all went to a Longhorn Steakhouse. Shout out to Longhorn Steakhouse. You want to send us some gift cards. And uh, me and Justin were just trying to, you know, hook them up. You know, we're trying to hook them up. There, there was electricity between them two, and we felt it. It was palpable. But uh, Decker, he just, he didn't want to bite. He didn't want to bite. So, you know, we, we tried to make some moves for him. But, you know, at the end of the day, you, uh, you lead a man to water, but you can't make him drink. 
on the menu today, Brian. Got some Panda Express. All right, can't not a bad go, choice. Can't go wrong. <laughs> What's happening? Well, we keep running out of office supplies. First it was highlighters, and now we're losing our note cards. Like index cards? The, was, little, the postcards that we used back in grade school with our math problems. So I'm trying to help out J Chains, so I was going to try to tape parts of the show, like uh, little factoids and questions on the note cards, but someone keeps taking them all. Do you know where all the note cards are? Dude, oh my Love god. I didn't take any note cards. Don't be out here saying I took note cards. Dude, okay. <laughs> <laughs> If anything, I, what, what what is it? it? It's it's not entrapment. I mean, you're just planning evidence. Look, I'm not Johnny Cochran. Dude, all right. This is grim, dude. I'm winning this comp. This today, I'm winning this. See, look, you <laughs> come on. I told you. Today, I did not take the index cards. Damn. That's today, though. Wink, wink. So, J Chains. Hey, hey, what's up? You hosting around the blockchain today? I am. I'm going to be hosting around the blockchain tonight. So, by the time you're watching this, it will have already happened. So, make sure you tune in and watch after it already happened. <laughs> <laughs> you nervous? I know you don't no, get nervous. No, never. No, yeah. I don't get nervous. Oh, uh, you know, like, so nervous is like one of those things like, no, like, I'm not like, uh, I'm not afraid to talk to people like in, uh, you know, public speaking, stuff like that. I think, you know, always like, you know, the last time I did this show, you know, there was some things that happened. We picked up Crypto Stash from the airport. The car broke down. We were running late. I was feeling rushed. I don't feel like I gave a good performance. And like, one of the things I always want to do is be better than I was the last time. So I'm not nervous. I'm just making sure that I'm more prepared so that I give a good performance. Perfect. You can't crush it. Thanks, man. How are we feeling, ZZ? Doing good, man. Doing good. It's going to be an interesting show. We got old Jay Chains here, Jay Nasty, uh, filling in for TJ. He's probably going to be doing it yeah. full time eventually. We got so uh, we got some great guests uh, yep. and no Ben. About so uh, uh, it's, the, all, it's all on his shoulders. Yep. Yeah. You got this. You got this. What is going on, everybody? Welcome back to Around the Blockchain here on BitBoy Crypto. You know, this is the largest crypto community in the all of the interwebs my name is justin or jay chains i'm gonna be filling in for your second favorite host here for around the blockchain that's tj okay we love him anyways but it's i'm here i'm gonna host for you we got a great show today Easy. It was a good one. It was a good one. Jay Chains, boo! Knocked it out of the park. Uh, Crypto Jeb, as always, Altcoin Daily. Crypto's Chain, Johnny Hooper, also Johnny Crypto. Right. Little, but it went good. Spelling snafu. So Altcoin Daily became ATL Coin Daily, uh, which maybe is in the area. I don't know. We're in Atlanta for I those think, who don't know. So maybe he's moving That's out here now. It's premonition. It's got to come out. Days. So BJ. Yes, Frank. We, uh, we were streaming on more than one platform, I heard today, huh? We did, so obviously they've been on YouTube for quite some time. Uh, DZ and I come from the Twitch world of gaming and all that, so we ended up doing the YouTubes, the Thetas, and hold on, hold on, oh god, uh, uh, enhance, <laughs> the Twitches. So now you can watch us on three different platforms all at the same time. You, um, like if we say something super cool and you're like, oh, I want to hear that again. It's almost like instant replay depending on the delay that's there. So check it out, spread the word. And uh, Theta, I'm not as super familiar with it, but it is a blockchain based platform. So you actually can earn rewards by streaming and viewing. So how do we feel about that, Justin? Good, man. I think that that was, I did a lot better than the last time I hosted the show. Nice. You know, I was able to prepare. I wasn't in a rush, wasn't in a kind of in a frenzy from, from showing up late. So I think I did all right. I, well, I think I did better than all right. I'm happy with it. It was a fun, great conversation. Those are a great group of guys, you know, some great perspectives. So I think we hit this one out of the park today. Awesome. Uh, so do you want to close this out for the day too? Call your mom, tell her you love her, buy some Bitcoin, do your own research, and always buy the dip.